Plane caught fire because the co-pilot confused left and right? No way. According to BBC News, a British Airways co-pilot messed up takeoff because he mistakenly moved a lever to his left when he was supposed to move a lever to his right. Wait, would a commercial pilot really make such a rookie mistake? No. Or is this just clickbait journalism? Let's take a look at a Boeing cockpit. The co-pilot sits on the right-hand side. The engine thrust levers, the ones that control how much power the engines deliver, are in the middle between the captain and co-pilot. So, BBC, what lever on the co-pilot's right-hand side are you even talking about? So I dug deeper and found the actual AAIB report, and here's what really happened. During takeoff, the co-pilot normally have his left hand on the thrust lever, ready to push them forward to power up the engine, and his right hand on the yoke to pull up the nose for a lift off. But instead of pushing forward using his left hand and pulling back with his right, he accidentally pulled back on the thrust lever with his left hand. That's a move you'd make when landing, not when you're trying to get off the ground. That brain fart got real expensive. They had to abort takeoff and the right landing gear caught fire from the overheated brakes. So I need your verdict now. Is mainstream media keeping us informed or just trying to get a reaction with headlines like these?